The owners of Young Galila Authentic Hunan Restaurant, which caused controversy after news of their two outlets being adorned with wallpaper bearing elements of communism and a communist leader went viral, have no intention to portray elements of communism as claimed by various quarters. According to their lawyer, Dev Kumara Endran, it was never his client's intention to portray any element of communism using the wallpaper. He said this when accompanying his clients to have their statements recorded at the Northeast District Police Headquarters in Georgetown this afternoon, Wednesday, January 13th. They have said the restaurant in Pulau Tikus had been in business for the past four years and the one in Icon City for two years using the same wallpaper from the very beginning. Malaysian, the wife is a Chinese national. They've been here for a long time. <coughs> And today they've been asked to come and give a statement to the uh, investigation officer here in Penang. Tomorrow they'll be heading to BM for the investigation officer in BM. Reason being there are two outlets. One is in Pulatikus and the other one is in Bukimataja. Okay. Uh, the reason they're only coming now is because both of them have been quarantined since the 31st of January. So this morning the quarantine finished and they were tested as negative. That's why they're coming as soon as they can. They couldn't come before when everything blew up in the press. All right, so uh, they're going to give a statement today. I'm sure uh, all of you will understand. I cannot comment further on the actual case itself because it's under investigation, but uh, they will cooperate today and tomorrow. And if the need be, uh, be called back again for any further statements.